Hey guys, it's Renee. So for today's dessert, I wanted to share this idea. I actually saw it on Pinterest. But the original idea, I think they used uh, peanut butter, but I really just want to go and add my chocolate, of course, because I love chocolate. So yeah, I just want to share this idea. But before we start, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. As far as for ingredients, we're going to be needing apples, and I believe I used two out of these three apples. Kind of a two tablespoons, probably. I didn't measure anything, but I think this is kind of like two tablespoons of shop nuts. And then some semi-sweet chocolate. I didn't measure my chocolate as well. Sorry about that. It was a half a bar of chocolate. But, you know, it always depends on how much chocolate you want to add to your dessert. Then I'm just going to be using this barbecue sticks that are really thin. One of these metal tablespoon coffee scoops. And some mini cupcake wrappers. Okay, the first thing that I'm going to be doing is just cutting my apple and using my scoop. And this is um, using this metal scoop is just going to give us the perfect size. And I'm just going to then place my tiny bowls, we could say, on this water mix that I do have a tutorial on my channel. It's just this tiny tip. It just prevents apples from browning. It's pretty helpful. And I'm just going to, you know, do that. Keep on doing that. Adding all my pieces of apples on that mixture. In that video I just go more into detail on how long and what ingredients I use but then uh, once you're ready to remove your tiny apples from your water and just you're going to place some napkins and pretty much going to stick my barbecue sticks in there and I just wanted to do that before like I let my apples dry because when you put the stick on some water is going to come out of the apple and as you notice I'm placing some barbecue sticks on like the green part or the outside and some others like you know vice versa that's because I want to have like two options well that dries I'm just going to be working my chocolate I did temper my chocolate following the instructions that come in my package but I'm just going to take my at this point barbecue sticks and my apple I'm just going to submerge the whole thing and this pretty much is the same thing as a cake pop if you have done cake pops before this is going to be like super easy and you're going to be familiar with it um, I actually found it quite easier to just work with this kind of um, barbecue sticks rather than using the white lollipop sticks that usually uh, people use to you know make cake pops uh, this is much easier for me, but anyways, I'm just going to go ahead with my nuts and I'm just going to cover the whole thing in nuts. The green part on the top, I'm just going to cover everything but that part, so it's going to be like showing the green part. And then I'm just going to kind of remove the excess of chocolate and then I'm just going to cover everything in nuts. And that goes um, on my cupcake wrappers as I did before. My fave is chocolate and nuts, but I just want to, you know, to give you another option of things that you can use or do in case you want to have like a table full of desserts, you have more options. And here I'm just showing you that you can use some sprinkles as well and just go all the way with it or just, you know, have the sprinkles and this is how the whole thing is going to look. I think it looks super cute in this way, but again, it's um, another option that I want to share. And this is how the whole thing looks with uh, white sprinkles. I think this is another option. A bit more elegant in my taste. Something a bit more mature maybe. I don't really know. I just want to share this two ideas. Well, actually three ideas. Again, if you don't have one to have like the cupcake wrapper showing through, this is just, uh, you know, for transportation. Uh, but if you want to like you know, have the apple as it is, you can remove that from your cupcake wrapper, so no big deal. I honestly super recommend it. They taste delicious and they are super fun to look at. If you liked it, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel for more stuff and share it. Thank you so much for watching and um, I hope you enjoy. Give it a try and I'll talk to you later. Bye guys!